Hello guys and welcome to the first episode of Season 2 of Planet Base. Thank you very, very much guys. All the comments, I've just been reading through them from the last season, the last episode, when we passed 300 colonists on our planet. Thank you for all the comments, it was absolutely amazing. You guys, really, I asked you, what did you want to see for the next season? Should we skip this one and jump straight to here? It was overwhelming that we're going to go for Class F, the challenging planets this is overwhelming this is challenging we have the same things to aim for down here but there is some challenges that are in with this one here just before we dive into that thank you for all your comments thank you for all your likes as well on the first season you guys loved it as much as i did if you enjoy this please leave a like it really does help and i always mention if you're new please subscribe as well so what do we get on this planet here? It's an outer planet with a nitrogen atmosphere. The thickness of the atmosphere prevents much of the light from reaching the surface. Ah, so light amount low. Solar panels operate at reduced, reduced capacity. Atmosphere density high, so good for wind turbines. So we've got to remember that. Good for wind turbines. Don't forget two minutes into the episode. Sandstorm none, that's good. Solar flare low, meteor low. Excellent. So this is Biffa Base version 5. Here we go. So what's happened here is some of the guys from the last base, a bit overcrowded, it got to sort of 380 and they thought enough's enough so they've moved to this new planet. <laughs> that's what's happened, honest. Uh, let's try and find a nice big open area rather than just, someone said do potluck, spin the planet, see where you end up. Yeah, that's nice but I mean, as much as you can tell when you do this, I don't know. I mean, some of these, that looks, that looks like it's open. I don't know. Let's start the game. Let's see what we get. Uh, right clicking the message. Okay, well, that's worth knowing. Here we go. Let's press any key. And the guys are coming into land. Let's see how many we get. So I don't know whether that changes as well. What have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Meteorites landed already, a frozen landing, and one bot. Okay, let's get things going super quick. We are going to need some power, power storage from O2. We're going to need all sorts of things. Let's do an oxygen generator. Uh, we'll build one of those over... What have we got, supply-wise? Let's have a look at that as well. 30, yeah, we'll build a large oxygen, gen oxygen generator. We've got a nice space to build here. Fantastic. So we're going to have mines around the side. Okay. Can't mess around too much. Let's put that down. Get them building that. We'll add an airlock onto there. So they can get in and out. Let's do it this way. Because this is where the mine is going to be eventually. There we go. You can build that. We're going to need a canteen, a biodome and some power. That's the other thing. So let us get... Wind turbine requires solar panel. Oh, seriously, you have to build a small solar panel before you can do anything else. This could be like a little outside section with stuff. So if we go that way... So how many is that? We're, let's speed things up. We're doing... Oh, that's already got what it needs. So's that. So's that. Alright, that's going to give us power, and then we really need to store power. Let's slow things down a bit. We're going to get running away with ourselves here. Uh, four power storage. Let's go this way. There we go. <clears throat> so let's get that going. Get some... Oh, and of course it needs water, doesn't it? Oh, man. Getting oxygen actually going. It's going to be so flipping hard. Okay. Uh, water. Water extractor. That can go outside. I'm going to go for the biggest one of those. Let's just head up this little alley up here. We are going to run out before we even start. Run out of stuff. We can get the basics going. So that's got what it needs. Okay. So that's two, three. And then other than that, it's going to be food. We've got 20 meals, so they're okay at the moment. The bot's inside. And then I want to add... That is operating at really low yield. But that's okay at the moment. So... What have we got people-wise? Oxygen generators out of water. We'll be solving that in a minute. We have two workers, two biologists, two engineers, a medic, and no guards. There we go. We're now making water. Let's take a look at this one. 
There we go. Plenty of power, plenty of water, plenty of oxygen. Hooray! They're all running in for their oxygen. Quick! We need to get in. Okay, food. Let's get food going. Or we'll power storage, because at night we're already going to run out of power. So do you know what? I'm going to add a wind turbine in, a nice big one. Because they will work... Oh my goodness me, that nearly took out my power. My power storage, that would not be good. So we're going to have to be careful what we rely on here for power, as these don't work at a very high efficiency, hence only building the small one. We may end up removing that. Okay, we've got a lot of stuff. Let's just let them build that. Let's just have a quick look around as well. Nice big plain. We've got an area we can head out there. Nice area here, little bit there. And this is sort of like a dead end. Maybe loop around a bit. Yeah, so we'll have that as our outdoor, outdoorsy stuff. What's the matter with you? Oh, water. They're going to need water, aren't they? So let's get... <clears throat> uh, what should we have? A canteen. A place for them to eat and drink. I'm going for the larger stuff as well. Let's put that there. There we go. We can add a water doohickey in there for them to get their water. Food are okay on. Wind turbine's been built. What's that making? Oh, wow. 40 out of 50. Fantastic. Plenty of power. That's good. So let's get the canteen built. Let's have a quick flick through here. We mind ourselves. We've done that. We haven't got anywhere for them to sleep, but that's okay. Oh my goodness. Can they not get in and out the door now? <laughs> they can't, can they? Because <laughs> there's no power. Come on, work. Darn you, work. Why is that saying zero of zero? Produces zero. That's produ oh, okay. Oh, did something hit that? I must have missed that. Something hit that. That's not very good. Yeah, look. Some of them need water already. Well, we'll get that sorted with the canteen. That's fine. Uh, beds will get soon. Biodome will do next for growing vegetables. Um, and then once we've got that, I think we'll get that going as well. Let's do a nice big one of those. That's going to take seven. Let's not go for a nice big one of those. Let's keep ourselves some spare. Um, what should we do? Go for a two. Let's go for a five. I just want to be able to have enough to build a mine. Otherwise that will... Really, yeah, two for a mine. Glad I thought of that. So we'll go for a five. Oh, we can take this apart, can't we, if we need to? Yeah, I forgot about that. Let's go for a large one then. There we go. We'll add that there. Battle storage is critical. Because that stops. Okay, that's going again. Canteen's been built. Get the connection done. And then I can put the stuff in here that we need. There we go. Let's get the water things in first. There we go. Of course, then we need something to make the food, don't we? <laughs> I'm getting confused here. Oh, yeah, biodome. No, I'm not getting confused. What am I talking about? I'm confused that I'm confused. I'm not confused. Uh, meal maker will have one for now. And then table and chairs have one of those and we'll just take it easy for now yeah look they're all getting thirsty that's it you build build these can I, set, I can't set the priority on that you remember you can now set the priority on buildings that would have been good to go first hopefully we've reached survival hopefully then don't, don't die of lack of no here we go look they're coming in to build the mill maker build the other things yep Oh, please. You should recycle the colony ship. Okay, let's do that then. Oh, please get some water before you die. Don't die, don't die. The lack of water. Yes, there we go. We have some water things. Phew. Now it's just tiredness. That's okay. We can deal with that. Let's stick a dorm in. Yeah, we've got plenty of stuff now. How many of them is there? There's not that many. Can we squeeze a little dorm in here? Maybe this way? This way. Just a small one. Let's connect that. <laughs> Will that not connect to there? Whoa, what did that hit? So that is filled up. What are we using at the moment? 
Um, bum, 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 bum. 11 out of 65. We're doing fine. Okay. Let's have a look. Yeah, they'll be okay. They'll be okay. We'll get this built. They can sleep. Of course, it's this, isn't it? It's only got one. It's a dead-end connection thing. I thought the canteen gave you more than one connection. Oh, it's the dorm. It's the dorm that doesn't have the connection. Maybe that's not the best place to put that. Uh... Yeah, I'm just going to move that, actually. That isn't the best place to put that. Let's squeeze that in over here. Yeah, that'll do. Let's go there instead. There we go. There we go. We're down to 12 meals. Oh my goodness. Can we make the meals? Get making a food. Get making a bed before they drop down of starvation and sleep deprivation. So I'm thinking the mine over here. Processing stuff over here. So it's not too far to go. What have we got power storage wise? We are making tons of power. Lots of meat. I thought meteor risk on this planet was low. Oh, whoops, don't want to do that. Seem to be quite a few meteors going on. Let's just speed things up a bit. Come on, let's get the Oh, that's finished. Nope, the connection isn't finished. Let me get I want to get them to do this first. We have seven meals left. <gasps> Let's just slow down a minute. What's going to be a good, fast, fast production? Let's add a couple of fast, a couple of normal. Let's just get that going. Oh, didn't mean to do that one. Let's recycle that. Medicinal pads. I've got five medicine. We'll worry about that in a second. I want to get the beds up so they can have somewhere to sleep. And the meals. Oh man, it's so touch and go at this stage, isn't it? It's like, are they going to drop dead of hunger first or tiredness? Okay, here we go. Okay, if anything's slowed down, let me put some beds in here. Let's put two, four, six. That'll do. Because how many people do we have? Seven. Oh, typical. Okay, we'll do another, another set of beds. There we go. Potato pads built. Fantastic. So it's going to be storage next. Hopefully this is going to be a good start. Come on, you can do it. You guys can do it. And then we'll add some potted plants and stuff in here. What's the bot that we've got? Is he a carrier bot? He is. Really need more power storage, don't we? Very quickly, things are getting... Getting ahead of us. And the next thing is mining. So as soon as the beds are built, we're making food, hopefully. Come on, make those beds. Yay, Judd. He's made his bed, now he's going to sleep in it. Look at that. That is a good idea. Come along, make your bed, and then jump straight in it. Here comes Alma Hanks. Oh, you're not going to make it. Fair enough. Neither are you. He's like, no, I'm not going to make beds for anybody else. I'm just going to sleep. Look, make these two beds, and then other people can sleep. <laughs> is that my two engineers that are asleep? I've only got two, haven't I? They are. Cheeky so-and-sos. They've gone to sleep. No other beds can be made. I'll tell you what, they can carry some stuff in. Let's get a couple of pot plants in here. There we go. Uh, tables are okay. Meal makers, we don't need any more. Yeah, I'm not going to build anything else. We'll be getting starch from these. Oh, they're breaking down already. Fantastic. And uh, we've got nine and four. So what else do we realistically need to survive? Another power collector would be good, but don't need that just yet. We're hoping that's not going to get hit. Auction generator, we've got canteen, dorm, biodome, processing plant. We're not at yet. Because we need... I need a mine. I saw that go past the corner of my eye. Multi-dome bar. No, we're not near that yet. Storage, no. Sick bay. Uh, we could probably do with that, that for now. I reckon it's going to have to be mine, isn't it? We're getting power. We're getting water. Landing pads. We don't really want more colonists until we're making food. 
Yeah, I reckon a mine it's going to have to be. Let's stick it right opposite here. I've put it over this way. Oh, that's good. Maybe it's a bit too in. So if we go here. Well, let's go for the nearest one first. There we go. That's nice and close, isn't it? Should we connect it there? Oh, come on. Let me connect. There we go. That'll be good. What does a mine take? Two. That's fine. Food stocks are low. I know. Oh, they're working on them. He's unhappy about it, but he's working on them. I haven't got any food in yet. And we've got no starch. So hopefully... We've got things that are starchy that will make starch. So let's see how that goes. Oh my goodness me. Oh my goodness me. Um... And we don't have any spares or anything yet. So we need to be thinking about that. Mine has been built. Fantastic. There we go. So then my workers are going to start jumping in there. And with only two workers. Everybody should be sleeping okay. Three meals left. And no more starch. Oh, wow. Yep. Yeah. Two meals left. Our food stocks are low. Wow. Are we even going to survive the first couple of nights? The first try at this? Because our food is so low? I hope so. I'm not going to set that as high priority, I don't think. Because where are my engineers? Are they eating? Not engineers, biologists. That's my engineers. That's my biologist. Yeah, he's going to eat. He's eating a meal rather than... Oh my goodness, 86%, 77, they're so slow. We have no food, and I can't add any more. I was wondering whether... Uh, let's add a couple of rice pads. We can't build them yet, but as soon as we, got, we get some starch, we'll build some of those. Oh, we do have 10 spares, that's fine. And we do have 5... Medical. Yep, we've run out of food. Five medical supplies. I'm so hungry, I'm going to stare at this plant. You could eat the plants. Hopefully people don't stop working now just because there's no food. Oh my goodness. Are you gonna, you're going to work in the mines. Okay, that's good. Can we build... A processing plants? We need two starch. Hmm, that was going to come off of this side, wasn't it? What do we need? Four... Oh, it's not going to let me put it here because of all this stuff. Darn it! How close can I get it? Oh, there we go, look. Is that as close as I can get it? It is, but that will do. Yay, we've got some vegetables. Now, hang on a minute. I might just go for a smaller one. Let's do that again. We've got some vegetables... Let's go for a two. Oh, there we go. Yes, that's better. There we go. And we've got a, we've got a piece of... Hang on, is that taking bioplastic? Oh, no. Oh, I may have completely messed up. I can't build that unless I have two bioplastic. I can't make bioplastic. Okay, we're going to do a bit of recycling here. Recycle that, and recycle that. Yes, there we go. Phew! And that takes one as well. Um, recycle... That hasn't actually been made with anything yet. Let's just get rid of those, just in case. We're going to recycle one of the beds. Yes, because they're not all sleeping at the same time. Phew! That was close. We're now making food... Fantastic. Power's okay. Food, power, and air. As long as we can keep those things balanced, we're doing okay. Power's alright. Water's okay. Oxygen's okay. Another power storage thingy would be good once this is made. I may need to recycle another piece of bioplastic from somewhere. So I can make the machines that go in here. In fact, I probably will. I may take another bed away. 
Don't sleep in your beds. It'll be gone in the morning. How are these guys doing? Yeah, we're building up there. That's good. Okay. So we want one of each machine here. Let's have a look. So one of these and one of those. So that takes... Oh, no, that's okay. They just take those to make. Good. Oh, well, that's easy enough to do. We've got plenty of those left. Oh, I think we might have... We might have made it. Let's check our milestones. We've done survival, self-sufficiency, meal maker, mine, biodome. Yeah, as soon as we've done these two things here, we'll have self-sufficiency. Which is not a bad start then, is it? So how are people generally feeling? Let's have a look. Uh, unhappy, but not too bad. They've got a pot plant to look at. Power storage. I really think we need to go for another power storage. Self-sufficiency! Hooray! Power collector takes one to four. I would like to add another large one of these. Maybe not round there. We'll keep that for our indoor, indoor stuff. Um, could just attach that up here, couldn't we? I don't know. We haven't got the stuff to make it yet, so we'll just hang on, I think. So now at least we can make stuff as well. There we go. How's our food stocks doing? Some of that starch... Oh, our bot's going to go any time. Yeah, let's add a few more. We're going to add some pea uh, rice pads in here. Let's have a couple of those. And a couple of those. That's be our next priority, to get more food from that. Yay, there we go. Making the starch. Fantastic. Oh, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. The next one is expansion. Get new colonists to the base. Well, we'll wait until we've got more food and stuff. Our bot is going to collapse. Uh, oh, here he goes. He's getting prepared. Prepared. Repaired. We've got lettuce pads. Excellent. I don't think we're doing too bad. This is a good start. And this is a nice big base here. As long as we're careful with what we build where... Trying to make sure that we keep our buildings that have lots of connections in the middle. And then we can build things like dorm, oh, excuse me, dorms and that off the outside. Hiccups. Um, I think that's good. I still would like another power storage, but we're not really mining much, are we? We're not getting many resources in. What are these all over the place? Oh, storage, yes. Um, although at the moment... I mean, unless a meteor was to hit that, they're doing okay. Uh, yeah, you're still working even though you're slightly unhappy. How unhappy are you? Not too bad. It is a potty plant to look at. I think once these are built, I'll add some more happiness things in there. But at the moment, how unhappy are you? Yeah, not too bad. You're going to the pea pod. Okay. Yeah, things are being stored on the floor at the moment. But that's not too bad. That's not too bad. As long as these things don't deteriorate, we can store things on the floor. And they will last long enough. So there doesn't seem to be a difference in how much nutritional value something has if it deteriorates. It just The deterioration is just that. It deteriorates, then disappears. But we're okay with that. I really want this to be... Get them working on that. I suppose at the minute my workers are doing a lot of carrying and stuff, aren't they? Hmm. Look at the potted plant. Yep, there we go. You're staring at the potted plant. Good. Where are you going? Off to work? Work in the mines. Fantastic. Yeah, we need, need processing a bit more. You keep working on this one, but not this one. I do have two workers, don't I? Yeah. Could we get some more people in? We probably could, I reckon. I mean, storage would be nice and all that sort of thing, but I reckon we could put one of these here and hopefully get that built. Yeah, let's do that. 
we need more people, don't we, to start getting the work done. We've got the beds. We're, we, you know, we're getting food. A couple of people would be okay. Um. Oh yes, we can't do the landing permissions until it's built. That's what I was waiting for. That's not going to be built for a while until these guys get on with this. I might just up the priority here. Although... Oh, you're injured. Oh, we do need a med bay, don't we? Of course. Let's not up the priority on that. Let's let's cancel that. We'll do a med bay first. Um, bah, 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 this one here. One and two. So that's actually not far off being done. Two and two. One and two. Let's make a small one. We squeeze that in here. Is that going to stop us building our starport? Not our starport, our landing pad. No, that will still go there. Okay, let's do that then. Let's have the med bay there. One and one and one. Yeah, so they really need to... Let's just up this. I want this to be worked. That needs one of each as well. So let them... Oh, here we go. Yep, get them working on that. Get the med bay done. We've got five medical doodabs, plasters, band-aids. Food's not doing too bad, actually. Maybe another meal maker at some point. Just want them to finish this darn thing here. 54%. Who is he that's got a broken leg? Oh, it is one of our workers. Darn it. Okay. So he's probably not going to do much. So let's hope our other worker... What's her name? Alma Hanks. Let's hope nothing happens to her. Don't trap your hand in this machine here. I said, go on, finish it. 100%, please. 300, 100. Yes, there we go. So we've got enough to finish this now. Yep, one and one. Let's get that done. Where's our workers that are going to carry the stuff? Here we go. Engineers, bring in what he needs. Good old Judd. Poor Billy, walking around with his broken leg or whatever he's got. I don't know what night seems to last a long time. Is it me or... Oh, not my mic, sorry. Is it me or are nights lasting a long time? I think they might be. How's the power storage doing? Yeah, not too bad. I think we're getting to the point where... Let's have a look. Yeah, we're getting sort of close, aren't we? Aha! Excellent. We've got what we need. Let's put that back down to normal so they don't stop eating and stuff. We've got a medic. Yeah, we do. Apparently, on the other um, the other planet, you don't get a medic. Oh, yes, excellent. You've built that as well. Let's pop a bed in. There we go. Just the one for now. We've got the bioplastic. We can get old Billy here. What's his name? With a broken leg. Who's wandering around doing nothing. Yeah, Billy. Get him fixed up. Yay, there we go. Come on, Billy. Come and lie down. Where's the medic? Oh, the bot's going to come and see if he's okay. What is the needs at the moment? It really is unhappiness and sleepiness. Although it's not getting to a point where it's too bad. Ah, yep, yeah, you're going to treat him. Phew. Food is doing okay, actually. That is not doing bad at all. It's this here, which... Yeah, if we stick a start... I don't know whether to go for... I mean, spares, we've got nine. We need to keep an eye on that. I think power storage, we really need to get something. But we've got one, but we need more people. Yeah, we're going to go for... We're going to go for a landing pad. Let's attach that to there. And see whether that's going to be the right decision to make. I'm going to save that there because we're going to end the episode there. Guys, thank you very much for watching. If you're looking forward to the next season of Planet Base, Biffa Base version 5, please leave a like. It's greatly appreciated. And any comments as well. I read them all, even though there were so many left over the weekend. I didn't have a chance to read them all, but uh, to uh, reply to them all. Oh, someone else is injured. I always read them all. Thank goodness it's not our medic that's injured. And, uh, yeah, guys, we will see you tomorrow, the same time, every day, 2 p.m., uh, UTC, if you use UTC, or BST, or UK time. Uh, we'll be back for another one. So, guys, take care. I will see you then. Bye-bye.